Picking things up from the Crone Law Firm, Attorney Bill Walk and Attorney Joe Smith from Miles Mason Family Law Group. Good afternoon again, gentlemen. So we were talking about this bill. So now let me ask you this, because we were talking about it also off break, right. that it's really more important for a person to have their own insurance and not worry about trying to sue someone or having a law passed to protect them. It's really about you having your own uninsured motorist. Share that with us, Bill. Yes, absolutely. So in this city, like a lot of cities, a, a large majority of or a large segment of the population does not carry insurance. And so if someone doesn't have insurance, you're in, in big trouble if you get hurt bad. Mm -hmm. if you lose a spouse or a loved one or a parent. Mm -hmm. So I always recommend getting as much insurance as you can on your own, uninsured, underinsured coverage. That way it will protect you in the event that someone that has a DUI or otherwise that mm -hmm. causes an injury, causes a, a loss to your family. That child support would be an element of damages that you could recover from your insurance policy. Mm -hmm. So I think it's very important to make sure that you have proper insurance and not rely on the other driver right. to have insurance. So when you go into court or have law, where you're trying to recoup those funds, how does it work if they don't have anything? How do you recover your money then? Well, if you have uninsured motorist coverage, uh -huh. what uh, if you didn't have it? Well, you're not. You, you, there's you no way. You're, you're, you're out of luck. You can't sue the person that. You can, but the accident. You can, but if they don't have any money, if they, I mean, you're trying to garnish their wages or you're trying to chase them down. Oh, it, it turns it, into a bigger. Yeah, and it's hard right. to get any significant money. I mean, they may have to pay you, you know, thirty dollars a month, but that's not going to compensate you for your losses. Right. But with the good thing with this law is that you wouldn't have to start a separate civil action to get the child support. This will be part of restitution. So for those victims and families that are trying to get some type of um, closure, closure or, yeah. you know, you can avoid revisiting um, that trauma by going through a civil route, but when there is a sentencing phase, the court's going to order child support. So I think that's a good way. I think it's economic in a sense so that families and victims can get some type of justice for them instead of having to go through a separate legal action and try to get money from someone. Mm -hmm. So basically, long story short, just don't drink and drive. Sit down somewhere. <laughs> That's right. Love That's to right. Life continues and we return. <laughs>